Hey y'all, JS Creations Art Sanity here. So today I'm going to do this plum bowl. So to get started, um, those are just uh, stove, stove burners and I am putting plastic wrap inside there and that's where I'm going to. These are going to be like my molds that I'm going to pour the resin into. So that's my resin and I'm going to mix some wild plum alcohol ink in there and then just pour it into those molds there. And I don't know how much ink I put in there. I just kept squeezing some in until I liked the color. So I'll just dump it right on in there. use my heat gun to um, try to get all the bubbles and I'll try to pull straighten out this plastic wrap um, just so that try to get all the wrinkles out of there I do come in with the torch um, you have to be very careful because like this is plastic it will melt and I have done that So these are um, acrylic diamonds and I'm just sprinkling those around the edge <clears throat> thinking that it's going to give it um, a little extra sparkle but they do end up sinking down in there so on the finished piece you, you can tell that they're in there but it really doesn't give that sparkle that I was looking for but it's still pretty. So once I get all that in there, um, I will cover these and let them sit. Oh, at least at least a couple of hours. It just depends on what kind of resin you are using, um, the temperature that you're working in. Um, I've had to leave them sit anywhere from two to six hours before um, I try to shape it like what I'm doing here. And you want it to where the resin is really tacky, where it's not going to move too much anymore. And I'm just using an old base. I've got it kind of stuck there in the cup. Um, and for this one, I'm going to put these on one on top of the other. So try to make a double layer. And I let that set for 24 hours. And now I'm coming in. <laughs> almost dropped it. Now I'm coming in and um, just trying to pull out all that uh, plastic wrap. This is very time consuming. And it can get a little irritating. It does get down in the creases. So you really have to work at that. Try to pull all that out of there. So now I'm going to put these together. Um, I'm going to, I just dump some resin um, in the bottom of that one and then I will rub 
um, resin on the bottom of the small one and just stick them together and this one will be done. So yeah, if you like this video, please subscribe, give me a like and share, and yeah, thanks for watching.